Hello everybody, it's me, Bo Shemisu. And I put my life on the line so that you guys don't have to. <laughs> okay, go! <laughs> I smell burning flesh. And today we are coming with a handheld stun baton. This is not called a taser, that's the brand name. The actual brand name is Viper Tech. Now what's rather interesting about this is that it does turn into a flashlight like so, and uh, middle right there, and then when you push it all the way up, then uh, as indicated by the red light, when you push this, that's when you can deploy it. So Kelly here is my good friend and he is going to test it on me and I'm going to try to describe it like a fine wine. Whoo, it wakes you up. It's better than a cup of coffee, guys. It really is. How it's described best, I would say, is, is like a whole bunch of little needles are just jabbed into you. Um, I would say the worst part of this is the actual sound because that, that, that just makes you a little nervous right there. So with that being said, if there is an opponent who's a little crazy, um, they're probably not gonna pay any attention to that sound. And so you're gonna have to get close to them in order to deploy that. That's not good. You don't want to get close to a crazy person. Use pepper spray, use a gun if you have proper training. But this, if you have to use it, you certainly may. Now one other thing that's rather interesting is that they have a built-in plug. So you don't need to worry about cables. It just slides in and out and you pop it right into your wall. Now, the last thing that I want to leave you with is how long does it last? That's the big unknown. And so we are going to go ahead and hold it down. It says you're not supposed to hold it down for very long, but let's just push it to its limits and see what happens. Ready, set, go. Okay, we're just gonna stop it right there because it's getting a little annoying. That, that's surprising. That, that kept going. I have tested stun batons before that fizzle out after maybe four or five seconds. That's impressive, that's good. And also we have a pink one. It operates exactly like the black one that we're gonna be demonstrating here. And so coupled with the flashlight, let's say you're out walking your dog, you can still have a flashlight. That's not the brightest, but it's something. I would give this uh, a five out of five stars in form, I, in terms of self-defense, I would say, you know, go get hands-on self-defense training to try to keep that distance, but if push comes to shove, this will definitely work. My name is Bo Shevasu.